The ancient town of Ikirun, Oshun State, was host to Pastor Mrs. Adeyokuno and family as she was joined by friends and well-wishers to perform the burial ceremony of her mother, late Mrs. Comfort Adele Edundukun, who passed on to glory on Sunday 24th June 2018 at the age of 87 years. On Friday, August 24, 2018, a service of songs was held in her late mother's honor at the Redeemed Christian Church of God, Oshun Province 4 Headquarters, Ikirun, Oshun State, in company of family and friends, especially members of the Redeemed Christian Church of God family. They read scriptures and sang songs to God in celebration of a life well spent. Heart lifting and emotional testimonies were shared by relatives and friends of the deceased, highlighting consistently Ni Soladoe's show of love to family and friends. We are in one of our clearest hours. My son and his wife were with them. He called, she called all of us. She opened her boxes and treasure. And she said, I want you to know. Take what the man wants and we put the best from our boxes. Come on, come on, come on. Free guy here, see my mom right there. And commitment to the expansion of the kingdom of God. At the end of the evening, prayers were said for our children and close relatives. Name of Jesus. Number two, Mama died at 87. That was not a premature death. I speak into the life of every member of this family. None of you will hear you. In the mighty name of Jesus. The 
next day, a funeral service held at the same venue. In attendance was many distinguished ministers of the RCCG, including the National Overseer, Pastor J.A. Obayemi, the wife of the Assistant General Overseer, Mommy Odeshola, and many elders of the movement. Here, everyone had the chance to get a final glimpse and pay their last respect to the deceased. After the service, a joyful train of close relatives and ministers proceeded to Iwe, where our remains was laid to rest. Oh, 
to me Sorry, okay, warning The Bible reveal unto us It is appointed unto man To thy wants After death, judgment Each and every one of us we need to think concerning our <coughs> Afterwards, guests from far and wide were hosted to a reception. My late mother happened to be a woman of prayer, a woman of fasting. In fact, I told her she was still on marathon fasting. And uh, that's the major thing that we are going to miss. Every time she always say, Emara, no bad, that means you obtain mercy wherever you go. And that's really working for us. So she, she, she decided what we are doing by the grace of God. To God alone be all the glory. Amen. We want to thank God for the life of our late mommy. Our mommy was a devoted Christian, very industrious, caring, and loving mother. More importantly, she was a prayer warrior, and she was a great giver. She could give anything. And we thank God that she served the Lord to the end, and she saw the Lord even on her deathbed. That uh, She has um, indeed lived a very good life. When you see the offerings or of children of a woman doing so great in the Lord while that woman is alive, that is a major achievement. That is what every parent should clamor to become. There are some things I read about Mama. Mama is a disciplinarian. She doesn't take nonsense and she doesn't take no for an answer. She is very strict and she disciplines people very well. 